Hello, little ones. Behind here, in front of here, down there, over here. Everywhere, puppies. Yes. Yes, look at you guys. Mommy's out here, and it's this afternoon. And it's just me, and look at Dennis. Good thing that we have... Uh, have an easy way to make ice because look at this <laughs> like that's a lot of ice and it's not that hot today so I don't know wow did you see him run did you see him run wow ow can't eat my feet. <laughs> they hurt now. No wonder why mummies don't want to feed you. <laughs> we gotta get you to stop that. <laughs> Whoa. Oops. That one fell sideways. This is why I have all these blankets and things like that. They learn to play recovery. Now if I went over there and coddled the pup, the puppy would have stayed afraid and would have remembered that this is scary. So it's best to ignore and let them figure it out. And they do. It's a good way to handle it. One year we had uh, someone cutting the shrubs, all the trees, and uh, they reacted and ran for the hills underneath everything, afraid. And we ignored them. One person, this was during a visit, one person wanted to hold them and we educated that you should leave them alone. They, after they hid, uh, they came out and then the noise started again and they didn't react at all. It was the best way to handle it.